Ash, back at it with another one. Back in the rangy dangy, you know what I mean? Yo, I've tried to quit weed multiple times. A month ago, I told myself I woke up, man, this is the day I quit. This is, this is the real day I quit. Two hours later, I took an edible. Edibles got shipped to my door because a, a month ago or a couple weeks ago, I ordered them, got to my door, and as soon as I take that edible, I'm feeling good. Then it hits me in my, my conscious, my subconscious brain hits. Heart starts beating fast. I shouldn't have, I shouldn't have got high. I shouldn't have taken this edible. Oh no. Mind starts racing. Panic attack happens just like that. I'm out. Not out cold, but I'm just, I'm zoned out. I had to just get away. I had to go talk to someone real quick. I had to talk to my family real quick and just tell them that I was having a panic attack. But yet, it was just my conscious brain, my conscious self just telling my subconscious that, yo, you told yourself you weren't going to get high, but yet you're getting high. So I'm, I'm going to do this to you. I'm going to give you this so that you never do that again. And here I am now, you know, my old self is thanking me. My new self is thanking my old self for doing that. So I'm pumped. I'm great. I'm grateful. So this is Weed Detox day three, four, something like that. And, you know, I do have a little bit of a headache. Sometimes it will kick on and I'll kind of just feel uh, not myself. I won't feel as if as if my brain is telling me, hey, smoke a little, smoke a little, take another edible just to ease that off. But it goes away. The headache goes away and my brain eventually realizes that, you know, I'm not I'm not a monkey, I'm not a slave to it, so it turns back on and, you know, I'm back to normal. Obviously, you you it might be worse for you. You know, I've quit multiple times and I've taken multiple breaks, but if you have went months, years of straight, it's probably going to be a lot worse. But I'm here for you. Hit me up. Ask me if you need any questions or anything like that, you know? I'll try and help as much as I can. Because like I said, I've quit multiple times. There's been multiple days and weeks where I told myself I'd stop and I'd go back to it. But recently I've just been... Luckily, I think it's God or some higher power just telling me, Hey, brother, you said you were going to stop, so you stop. So stop now. Stop. Stop being a, a lame to your brain, dude. You don't always have to listen to it. Listen to yourself and eventually listen to... Just take some time away from all social media and really think to yourself, is this benefiting me? Do I really need this? Especially as a young guy. You don't really need it, man. You don't need those things. Trust me. You know, there's been multiple times where and I told myself I'd stop. And then some friend or someone would come by and, you know, my brain, hey, just a, just a little something, just a little hit, you know, it won't help. It, it won't hurt. That one hit turns into the next day smoking, the next day getting high. And then panic attack again. <sighs> Starts hitting. So, you know, this is just another accountability video. Just keep up. Keep it up. You know, keep meditating. Keep getting... 1%, 0.1% better. You don't even need to get 1%, 0.1% better. Even if you do somehow get back into that urge, don't smoke as much. And tell yourself and realize like, yo, this didn't help. This, this was not good for me. This didn't benefit me. I told myself I was going to stop. So stop. Bruh. But yeah, obviously meditation helps with being aware of those cravings. And when they kick in, you know, just go out and do something. Right now, I'm about to hit the lake. Usually, I'm at the gym, but right now, I'm at the lake, baby. So, I'm about to get, get a little run in. About to get the heart pumping in a good way. <laughs> you know what I mean? So, yeah, this is day three and four. I might, I might just switch up, and instead of going day to day, I might go week to week eventually. And, 
yeah, and just keep up on my word and stuff like that. So, you know, I'm with you. If you have any questions or anything like that, hit me up. I'd love to, to help out. So, Ash, out, baby. <laughs>